Hi, welcome to In Your Face Fitness, 10 minutes at a time. My name is Allison Stewart Kaplan. I'm the founder of AskInYourFace.com, and this is my friend Bree here. And together, we're going to take you through 10 minutes full body workout using this weighted body bar. Okay, so we're going to start standing up here. And by the way, you can purchase this at most fitness stores, anywhere from six pounds, I think all the way up to about 30. So we're going to start warming up the body and taking a nice little side squat. So you want to lift up nice and tall, relax your shoulders, always gazing straight ahead. Nice, your shin tip would be resting like on a shelf so that your neck stays nice and long. Exhale as you lower, dig those heels in. We're going to take about four more. One, come up with strong abdominal muscles. Good. Last two. Feel that heart rate coming up a little bit breezy? Yes. Okay, last one, each side. Nice, well done. Go ahead and pick up your body bar here. Again, if you're about hip width apart, toes are straight ahead, grounded through the four corners of your feet. So the idea here is to root through your feet, lower down, and then rise up. Press that body bar. So lowering slow. We're going to work towards 12 repetitions. So if you want to feel your inner thighs a little bit more, lift your big toe up inside of your shoe and make sure you can feel the inside edge of your foot pushing into the floor as you rise up. How about four more? Good, working shoulders here, triceps, feel that core. Good, quadriceps and glutes. Step together, hold this one up. Nice, exhale slowly lower. Taking a little bit of a stretch here, open the feet up once again, just about hip width apart, soften the knees, and then come straight up. So from here, we're just going to take a nice row. Lifting up and down slowly. Again, working the shoulders. Beautiful. Good. So go ahead now. I got to step. Okay, so feeling a nice stretch here in this forward fold, hugging the low belly in. And then let's inhale, come up nice and slow. Bring your body bar right in front of you here and then soften your shoulders down on your back so you feel nice and relaxed and in a natural posture. And we're going to take that right foot back and then press up tall as we come together. Let's do that again. So let's take 12 on each side. Good. Back. So actually it's my left, your right. There we go. So press up. If your shoulders are getting a little burnout, out, you can just hold like this. Take a little rest and then begin again. So I think we have about four more. So lift tall. This is a great butt builder. There we go. One more, everybody. Reach up. Exhale, release, taking again a little bit of a stretch. Catching your breath. Inhale, come straight up. Again, set your shoulders. So stepping back with your left leg. Good, bending that knee and then rise up. Exhale, inhale. So again, standing firmly in the four corners of your front foot. Good. How you doing, Bree? I'm doing good. Good. So we're going to take about four more here. Lift up as high as you can. You'll feel your abdominal muscles. Last two. And one. Hold it up. And exhale, fold. Beautiful. So coming up once again, set your body bar down, okay? So I want you to turn to the side, grab a hold of your body bar right in the middle, lift it up, immediately you're going to feel your abdominal muscles kick in, okay? And you should be able to soften and sort of pump down and up. So let's just try this. We're just going to add a little bit of a row. It's okay if your body bar wobbles a little bit. So again, you're feeling in your butt there, quadriceps. Continually hugging that belly in. And let's hold this next one. Press through the back heel. And then we're just going to isolate and work that lap muscle. Good. Of course, you're also getting a little bit of bicep work here. Whenever you pull weight into the body, you're always engaging your biceps. How many, Breezy? Four? Yep. Three. Make sure you're breathing. Two. And one. Stretch it. Set it down. Step together. Speaking of biceps, let's pick it up. Standing up nice and tall, we're going to work a bicep curl here. 
So your elbows are relaxed and your wrists are lined up right underneath your shoulders. Relax your grip. So as we bicep curl, we're going to step back and then we're going to come up strong. And other side, step back and strong. Back and strong. So keep your elbows into your side ribs. You want to really stabilize the shoulder. That's it. That way we can just target more of the biceps. Of course, you're starting to feel it in your forearms just a little bit as well. 12 more. I'm really not sure what number we're on. Okay. There we go. We're going to take four more because we don't have a whole lot of time left. Four, three, two, and one. Set your body bar down. We're going to turn the other way now. All righty. So left foot forward, right leg back. So just remember, you're going to work opposite arm and leg. So you can rest your hand on your thigh, shoulders down, heart always reaching forward, grab a hold in the center, and again, let's just start that little pump, little pump and pull. That's it. Last four, three, two, and one. So send that heel back, extend the elbow, and begin your lat row. Belly in tight. Nice. Lower with control. That's it. Last eight, seven. Squeeze your belly while you're at it. Four, so you can feel the support in your back. Two, and one. Go ahead and put it down. So moving on here, we're going to step into a plie. So we're turning out from the hip here. We're going to sink deeply. So your body should be very warmed up right now. So open up through the inner thighs a little bit. Carefully pick up your body bar. Really ground through the feet. Hands are just a little bit outside the shoulders. And from here, we're just going to take some little pulses. One, two. This is one of my favorite inner thigh exercises. Feel the inside edges of those feet breathe? Yes. That's it. So not a bounce. This is a deliberate press. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Let's take three. One, two, and three. Overhead, press one. Two more, breeze favorite. <laughs> and one, two, three. Come up strong. One, two, tight buns here. Good, again. One, two, relax those shoulders. Come up strong. One, two, three. Again, one. Get a little lower on the last one. That's it. One, feel the difference when you drop down a half an inch. Good. One, two, three. Press up. One, two. You got one more in you? One more. One, two, and three. Big lift. Two, and three. Lower back down. Step together. Fold forward. Good. Take a little breath here. And come on up. Beautiful. From here, hands just a little bit outside the shoulders. All right, we're going to row up into and reverse. So this is the opposite of just your ordinary upright row. Elbows come back, dropping the scapula and retracting into the shoulder blades. There we go. Nice. About four and three and two and one. Beautiful. Put it down. I think our hips need a little bit of loosening up, hey Brizzy? Yeah. So we're just going to roll a little bit. Good. So this is your pole here. It's great. This is a very versatile piece of equipment. This body bar just easily morphs right into a pole. There we go. So nice and loose through the hips. Careful not to glue your toes to the floor. And let's change sides. Good. Stick it on back there. Come on forward and hug the belly. That's it. Nice and relaxed. This isn't quite the Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> I'll show you that next. Last four and three. Come on, grind it forward. You really feel those core muscles kicking in? Yeah? Okay. I think we'll save the Marilyn Monroe for next time. So have a great day. See you soon.